Alright, so I'm going to show you guys how I do the slide jump at the beginning of Pillar of Autumn, because I do it differently than most people, and I can get a consistent 28 seconds, like half the time I try it, probably, and sometimes I can get 27 seconds, and I think 26 is possible, but I've never gotten that. Anyway, basically, you do what I did there, and that was a 28 a pretty good 28 second one. Here's an example of how not to do it. Basically, there is a place on the cliff that you can stand on, and what I always do is aim below that spot, and if you go below that spot, you get a good jump, and if you go above it, like right here, you still get a slide jump, but not as good of one, and also at that angle, it doesn't really allow you to get a second slide off of it. Here I'm going to show you again how I do it and the difference you'll see is that in this version I hit the cliff or whatever slightly lower and then after the first slide I try and slide right there again and you can just do a regular jump but if you actually do a, another slide jump you'll get more power but it's not really necessary. And that was a, not that great, but it was a 28 anyway. Now I'm going to show you guys how I line it up and everything. So basically, at that bush right there, I start sprinting and I jump at this one. And then I'll curve over the rock and land down there on the cliff side, right about where I'm pointing. And basically, this is the little area you can stand on right there. And if you want to get a good slide jump, you'll want to hit far up, as far up on the mountain as you can while still being below that spot. And if you go above it, you'll still get a decent slide, but it won't be as good. And you want to make sure you're not too low, because if you're too low, then you won't really get much of a slide at all. And then just remember to either jump or do another slide at the place where you land after this slide. And that should give you a 28.